Moo! Hello cows. So here we are, especially Worcestershire. We're saying goodbye to where we've lived for a long time. Uh, we've lived with these cows. Bye bye cows. Bye bye cows. See you next time. <laughs> uh, it actually all started in my living room. If you can see those trees, two miles the other side of those trees in my living room was where it uh, all started. And Andy, our cameraman, was right there with me. He's Hello, one of our. Um, we didn't even use this building to start with. This was our customer service building, and as you can see in the window, GTEC, we've moved, and the new address of where we've gone. So. Bye bye customer service room. Bye bye. We're going to go through and have a quick look where we develop all our products. So let's go through and see. So let's see where it all happens. Hi right, Jack. As you can see we've got state of the art um, wooden stuff bodged onto <laughs> containers. <Stop. laughs> all bodged together in a happy uh, G-Tech place. So come on in. Now this is actually new technology, so we can get there. This is all computer, computer controlled cutting and things. I'm not sure what we're making there. It looks like a grey block of plastic, so uh, very interesting stuff. Lovely. And we'll go Moving through on. here. And these are where we do testing and development work. Um, I like this notice they've put up. Welcome to the Dream Factory. Oh, oh sorry, went too camera. fast. Welcome to the Dream Factory. Be inspired. I like that bit. So the guys put that up few years back. All right, Chris. As you can see, we're busy packing up. Half the place is empty. Uh, Cam here is working hard. Morning, Cam. How are we doing? Yeah, very well, thank you. Um, and uh, we've got some products here. So this is how we develop products. So this fellow here, you're not supposed to look at that. So we might we might pixelate that out because that's not on the market yet. This is one of our earliest uh, developments of an air ram. So you can see it's kind of um, bits of plastic glued together, bits of metal. Uh, Andy and the guys made all this stuff. What does it say on here? Do not remove bin when motor's running. There's probably something really dangerous under there because it's a prototype. So, um, yeah, and it's bits of metal. This, I think, was guttering, wasn't it, Andy? Was that guttering is, off yeah. somebody's house? Yeah. Going, yeah. And then bits of different things are switched there. This was a later one, so this was more like what we actually launched in the end. So, hopefully, the bin does come out and you can see these bits look like production, but really they're there handmade and um, machine developed. Then this was one which was supposed to look like how the product's going to look. And this one, I believe, was purely for visual. So let's stick that back on there. And that's a concept for a new version of the Air Ram. Fancy. Um, yeah, so very good. Uh, we'll just have a little look in here. The other end of the scale is this sort of thing. So we can take computer designed uh, products, plug them into this big machine, and it spits out parts like magic. Now, when I started, we didn't have anything like that. Or you, Andy, right? You no, just uh, uh, draw it on a piece of paper, gave it to someone, they would make what they think you were designing. Now you can actually design it on screen and send it straight down to here. So, let's go and have a look at somewhere else. Well, as you can see, this is all going into boxes now. Uh, there were more desks, there's bikes where we used to hang our test e-bikes when we were developing our e-bikes. Um, and this man is very good at electronics. He taught us all about how you do software and electronics. He's expert at it. So, right. Hello, Mr. Electronics. Yes, dong, dong. Right, let's go. Okay, so we can wander back through here. Should we, should we have more of a chat with Cam before we go? Or, Cause we didn't really talk to him much, did we? But we got him a bit. Okay, we'll carry on. Okay. Oh, our electronics man overtook us. Raining a bit. July in Spetchley, Worcestershire. This is what you get, can't beat it. So this building, this has been our main office. This is where I've sat for the last 10 years or so. Um, when we moved in here, there was what, six or seven of us, Andy? Was it six yeah, or seven? So, yeah. yeah, not many. Uh, now there's 120 moving out, so uh, where we all fitted, I don't know. But we fitted, so that was okay. Hi, Em. Sorry, we're doing some filming, so you're on, you're on, get me on our website. Say hello, Em. No. Okay, don't say hello. <laughs> <laughs> guys drawing pretty pictures in there, very smart as well, very nice Hi pretty guys. pictures. Um, our coveted Queen's Award and some other industry awards, which we're very pleased to get as well. Okay, let's go and see the design office. Hi, Andy. 
so it would be this is the design office. Our purchasing team here are in the middle of a busy day's work. Hello, new girl. Sorry, I haven't said hello Hi. before. You're being filmed. I can only apologise for that. But um, sorry about that. It's it's her first week, and we've got her on camera already. Sorry about that. Uh, and then you got these guys are busy working on design and product design and. Whew, for at least the last 10 or 12 years, this is where all GTEC products have been designed and developed in this room. So, very special place. I'm very sad to leave. See you later, guys. Bye. Or well, say hello, I should say. Hello. You can... Hi. Bye. So, this is my office. I'm really sad to see it go. I've I actually bought this desk for £13 off the local council um, at least 12 or, or 15 years ago. So I've been using it ever since and it's going now. But the removals guys say they give me a tenner for it. So I've only lost £3, so I'm, I'm chuffed to bits with that. All, all, my, um, all my bits are going in. This is, uh, I've had this calculator from the beginning. Actually, the guy next door had the same calculator and kept nicking mine. So I wrote, this one is Nick's on the back, so we wouldn't get them confused. But he wrote, this one is Nick's on his as well, so we could still steal them. All <laughs> Yeah, so it didn't win in the end. So this is it. Next time we see you, we'll be in our new building in Warnden in Worcestershire. Um, just off M5 Junction 6. So, see you next time. Bye bye, Spetchley. Bye bye, Spetchley. Woo! Woo!